There is no denying that China's global economic influence has been on the rise, with the country becoming an important player in infrastructure development across the world. The Asian superpower has taken a particular interest in Africa and is working overtime to entrench its influence on the continent ahead of rivals like Russia and the United States of America. Consequently, through its Belt and Road Initiative, China is actively investing in infrastructure projects across Africa, including ports, railways, roads, and power plants. The Belt and Road Initiative is seen as a way for China to secure new markets for its goods and services, while also gaining access to raw materials and resources, so it is clearly an excellent strategic move that serves both its economic and political interests. China's investment in the $5 billion TEDA city project in Egypt has generated interest and speculation among economists, policymakers, and the media. The TEDA city project is part of China's ambitious Belt and Road Initiative project that aims to connect Asia, Africa, and Europe through a network of railways, highways, ports, and other infrastructure. The TEDA city project, which is located in the Suez Canal Economic Zone, is expected to cover an area of 7.2 square kilometers and to be completed by 2035. The project includes industrial parks, residential areas, commercial zones, and other facilities. In this video, we will delve deeper into China's decision to build a three-square-mile industrial area called EDA City in Egypt's Seuss Canal. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up, comment, share, and subscribe to the New Africa channel for more exciting future videos. China's Belt and Road Initiative is a global infrastructure and investment project launched by Chinese President Xi Jinping in 2013 and aims to enhance economic connectivity and cooperation in over 60 countries in Asia, Europe, and Africa. The Belt and Road Initiative encompasses a wide range of projects, including railways, highways, ports, pipelines, and telecommunications networks. China has pledged to invest more than $1 trillion in the Belt and Road Initiative over the next decade, making it one of the largest infrastructure and investment initiatives in history. Egypt, as a key player in the Middle East and Africa, has become an important partner for China's Belt and Road Initiative. China and Egypt have signed several agreements to enhance their economic and political ties, including a $45 billion deal for the construction of the new administrative capital of Egypt, and the establishment of a joint investment fund to finance infrastructure and industrial projects in Egypt. China's investment in Africa has also grown significantly in recent years. In 2021, China became Africa's largest trading partner, with trade between the two regions reaching $170 billion. China's investment in Africa has focused on infrastructure development natural resources, and manufacturing. China has invested in a wide range of projects in Africa, including railways, highways, ports, power plants, and telecommunications networks. China's investment in Africa has been criticized by some for its lack of transparency, environmental impact, and alleged exploitation of local resources. However, many African governments have welcomed China's investment as a way to boost their economies and address their infrastructure and development needs. TEDA City in Egypt is actually short for Tianjin Economic Technological Development Area City. It is a carbon copy of a highly successful Chinese development model. In China, TEDA is situated about 100 and 50 kilometers to the east of Beijing, with the Bohai Sea to its east. It used to be a vast land with saline alkali soil, but after more than 36 years of development, it rapidly evolved into a modern industrial zone. Today, TEDA is one of China's most successful and internationally recognized development zones. Sited on 33 square kilometers of land, it is home to over 7,000 companies from industries such as electronics, biotechnology, and manufacturing. TDA has also attracted multinational corporations such as Samsung, Toyota, and Coca-Cola, making it a hub for foreign investment in China. 
The zone's success can be attributed to its favorable business environment, including preferential policies for foreign investors, efficient infrastructure, and access to a highly skilled workforce. China drew up a plan to help Egypt build a similar economic zone in Suez as far back as the 1990s. With similar geographical conditions and its own story of successful transformation, TED-8 took up the task of assisting in developing the project. The first phase of the China-Egypt Suez Economic and Trade Cooperation Zone project began in 2008 with the building of a 1.34 square kilometer area. The second phase of the project, which spans six square kilometers, was inaugurated in 2016 by the leaders of the two countries, Xi Jinping and Abdel Fattah al-Sizi. Today, Egypt's very own TEDA city sits as an industrial park located in the Suez Canal Economic Zone, the outcome of a joint venture between China's TEDA Investment Holding and the SC Zone Authority. More specifically, it is located in the city of Ain Sakna, about 120 kilometers east of Cairo, and is strategically positioned near the Suez Canal and the Red Sea. The park covers an area of around 3 square miles or 7.1 square kilometers. For context, about 225 soccer fields can fit into one square mile, so the city is approximately the size of 675 soccer fields. It is designed to be a hub for various industries, including textiles, chemicals, building materials and equipment manufacturing. TEDA City is considered one of the major Chinese investments in Egypt, with an investment of $5 billion over the next 10 years. The park is expected to create around 100,000 job opportunities, boost economic growth, and increase trade between Egypt and China. In 2022, it produced an impressive export volume of $500 million. Based on the TEDA paradigm, the cooperation zone has been transformed into an industrial city rather than just a cluster of industrial firms, complete with hotels and even an amusement park, the TEDA Fun Valley, which attracts tens of thousands of tourists each year. The TEDA City Project in Egypt provides several key benefits for China. Firstly, the project supports China's economic interests by providing a platform for Chinese companies to expand their presence in Egypt and Africa. The project is expected to attract a range of industries, including electronics, textiles, and machinery, which will provide new business opportunities for Chinese firms. The project will also provide a gateway for Chinese goods to enter the Egyptian and African markets, which will help to boost China's export revenues. Secondly, the TEDA City project enhances China's strategic interests in the region. The project is located in the Suez Canal Economic Zone, which is a key transportation hub connecting Europe, Asia, and Africa. The Suez Canal is also a strategic waterway for global trade, and its security and stability are of great importance to China. The TEDA City project will help to secure China's access to the canal and enhance its ability to project its economic and political influence in the region. The project will also help to strengthen China's relationship with Egypt, which is a key player in the Middle East and Africa. Thirdly, the TEA City project is part of China's broader vision of creating a new economic and political order in the world. China's Belt and Road Initiative is aimed at creating a network of countries that are economically and politically dependent on China. The TEDA City project is one of the key components of this vision, as it helps to deepen China's economic ties with Egypt and Africa, and to establish China as a key player in the region. The project also demonstrates China's ability to undertake large-scale infrastructure projects in developing countries, which enhances China's status as a global economic and political leader. The TEDA City project does not only benefit China since it is located in Egypt. Therefore, the project will help to address Egypt's infrastructure and development needs, which have been a long-standing challenge for the country. The project will help to modernize Egypt's infrastructure by providing new industrial parks, residential areas, and commercial zones, 
which will create new job opportunities for Egyptians and boost the country's economic growth. As of 2020, the cooperation zone had attracted 96 firms and over 1.25 billion US dollars in investment. With sales revenues exceeding $2.5 billion, the businesses in the zone have paid taxes of over $176 million and provided about 4,000 direct jobs and 36,000 employment opportunities in related industries. In addition, the TEDA City project will enhance Egypt's strategic importance in the region. The Suez Canal Economic Zone is a key transportation hub connecting Europe, Asia, and Africa, and the TEDA City project will help to attract new businesses and investments to the region. The project will also help to enhance Egypt's relationship with China, which is a major economic and political player in the world. China's investment in the project demonstrates its commitment to supporting Egypt's development and enhancing its strategic importance in the region. Furthermore, the TEA City project will help to boost Egypt's global profile and attractiveness to foreign investors. The project is part of China's Belt and Road Initiative, which is one of the largest infrastructure and investment initiatives in history. By participating in the project, Egypt is signaling its commitment to economic development and modernization, and its openness to foreign investment. Finally, this project will open the door to more consequential Chinese-funded initiatives that Egypt will greatly benefit from. Indeed, during his talks with Egypt's leader, Abdel Fattah, Xi Jinping suggested that the two countries work together to make Egypt a pivot along the Belt and Road. He also promised that China would help Egypt with major projects such as the Suez Canal Corridor and the establishment of a new administrative capital. Nonetheless, the TEDA city in Egypt has faced criticism on several fronts. One of the major criticisms is related to environmental concerns. Firstly, the project faces security risks, as Egypt has faced a significant threat from terrorist organizations in recent years. The project is located in an area that has been targeted by terrorist groups, which could potentially disrupt the project's construction and operation. The security risks could also deter foreign investors and businesses from participating in the project, which could hinder its success. Also, the project faces environmental risks as it is located in an ecologically sensitive area. The industrial park has been accused of not adhering to proper environmental standards, with some reports suggesting that it has contributed to air and water pollution and habitat destruction in the surrounding areas. Local residents have reportedly complained about the negative impact on their health and the environment. The environmental risks could potentially harm the project's reputation and attract criticism from environmental organizations and communities, which could affect its long-term success. Finally, some have raised concerns about the level of Chinese involvement in the project. Some critics have argued that TEDA City represents an example of China's expanding economic influence in Africa, and that it may lead to a situation where Chinese firms have significant control over key economic sectors in Egypt. Despite these criticisms, proponents of TDA City argue that the industrial park has the potential to significantly boost Egypt's economy and create much-needed job opportunities. They also point to the fact that the project has received support from the Egyptian government, which has viewed it as an important tool for promoting economic growth and development in the country. Ultimately, the TEDA City Project in Egypt is a significant initiative that has the potential to provide substantial benefits for both China and Egypt. The project will enhance China's economic and strategic interests in the region, while also addressing Egypt's infrastructure and development needs. Irrespective of the numerous challenges and risks, this project will certainly help to modernize Egypt's infrastructure, create new job opportunities, enhance its global profile and boost its allure to attract foreign investors. It is also important that the project's benefits are shared equitably between China and Egypt, and that the project's impact on local communities is carefully managed and monitored. That concludes our video on China's massive $5 billion industrial TEDA city in Egypt. If you enjoyed this video, 
do check out our next one titled, Chinese Ambassador to the United States, Ken Gang Rebukes Claims of China Debt Trap in Africa. Remember to like both videos, comment your thoughts, share the videos, and subscribe to the new Africa channel for more informative and exciting future videos. Until next time, it's bye for now.